Okay, um, the next deck we're going to look at is the Raven's Prophecy Tarot by a Miss Maggie. Please forgive me for butchering your name. Um, by Miss Maggie Stifader? Stifader? Anyhow, um, I picked this up on a whim at Barnes & Noble this past weekend. I normally don't buy my tarot decks um, at Barnes & Noble. I just happened to come across this and thought I'd pick it up and check it out. Um, the one thing I really enjoy about this deck is it has an extremely good book that comes with it. Very comprehensive. Um, gives a lot of good meanings to the cards. Um, so... Um, with this deck, that is definitely needed. Alright, so let's take a look at the deck itself. Okay, pretty standard cardstock. Maybe a little bit thinner than some decks I'm used to. Um, the one thing I did see about this, about this deck, particular deck is that once you start flipping through you realize that the imagery um, definitely isn't what you would call true to form is in dealing with other tarot decks. So you really have to use your intuition and see what each of the cards tells you. She definitely, um, her artwork is actually really beautiful. It, it has a more goth feel to it, kind of like a, a dark and mysterious feel to it, which is nice, and I enjoy that in this deck. Okay, now we're getting into the Minor Arcana. Alright, so we've got the Ace of Cups. As you can tell, there really is... It really does deviate from the standard. So unless you're really familiar with the cards and the meaning of each card, you might have a little bit of trouble interpreting um, interpreting this during a reading. Okay, coins. It looks like she's using roses. Roses and flowers. I'm pretty familiar with the tarot since that's pretty much what I do for a living. Um, so for me, using this deck is not that difficult. Um, I would say again and reiterate, for a beginner, um, this definitely might be a challenge. It really is a gorgeous deck though. I'm gathering that this is a 
fairly new deck that's been put out pretty recently because I'm not I don't recall having seen it at any other point um, you can get it um, at Barnes & Noble I looked it up again you can probably pick it up for a few bucks cheaper on Amazon um, but it's pretty pretty close to the same price anywhere that you would um, attempt to get it well, she did a nice job so um, I'm pretty impressed with this deck um, I enjoyed it a lot and we shall see you next time and what other decks um, I come across. Alright, thank you.